Hello, my name is Shane Neal. Hello, my name is Clint Neal. We own the Neal & Neal team here at Keller Williams Realty in the San Antonio and surrounding areas. Today we're going to talk a little bit about how to prevent some different events that can happen in your house and save you from catastrophes. Yeah, but before we begin, I want to draw your attention to a couple links that are found in our blog. If you're looking to purchase a home, click the link about buying a home. You can have access to all homes for sale. Uh, and if you're interested in selling your home, uh, click that link and we can provide a free market analysis and really give you an idea of what your home is worth. Okay, so we're going to begin talking about really some things to prevent on wanted, really unwanted events that could happen while owning a home. And really the main thing that I'll kind of touch on first is make sure you have good insurance. Mm -hmm. And that's a, a lot of people, you might overlook that, but when something bad happens, that's when you need insurance most. So we do have great contacts if you'd like to get an insurance quote uh, and explore that option on your property. Yep, for sure. And plumbing, that's another one. A lot of these major events may start from just a little bitty leak somewhere or something that you always want to have that stuff well, yeah, It gets kind of overlooked. Mm -hmm. uh, the same thing with wiring. If code changes happen all the time in the wiring, uh, in the construction industry and all of that, so make sure that all electrical is even up to date uh, when it comes to that because all it takes is one little thing wrong that, that could turn into something huge. Yep, smoke detectors, carbon monoxide, all that kind of stuff are things you want to think about. They're super yeah. small, but having the right amount in the hallways and bedrooms. I mean, a uh, fire could go un I mean, unnoticed for a long time before you actually notice it. So putting it into areas that you don't travel a lot in your house. Making uh, sure the batteries, it's not beeping. That's yeah. a big one. Always changing the batteries <laughs> once a year. So that, yeah. that's a definitely a good one. Uh, trim the trees. Um, a lot of people really don't think about it. But when wind comes through, if you have trees that are close to your roof, they can sit there for months on end and just destroy the sides that they're actually rubbing against. So yeah. little bitty things like that, and every year those trees grow and get bigger and bigger. So you want to be real mindful of that stuff and keep them trimmed back away from the roof. So yeah, it's even, make, even a roofer. We've got a great roofing contact that uh, does a lot of stuff for us. Having them go out and assess your roof before you get into the real windy season and all of that. So just making sure really uh, the structurally, the roof, all that is good to go on your home. So little things like that, you just want to keep keep mindful of. Um, little things turn into big things. So being proactive and really tackling those items ahead of time save you so much time in the future. Yeah, well, I hope these tips helped you all out, kind of little, little things to help you out and kind of prepare going into the summer uh, season with it all. But, again, if you're looking to buy or sell, reach out to us. Uh, we'd love the opportunity to talk more about that or any real estate need that you might have. All right. Thanks so much. Have a great day.